Welcome to First Tech Challenge Oregon. I'm Kathy Sweeter and I am very proud to be the First Tech Challenge Oregon affiliate partner. My job is to kind of keep everything running around here. We have great volunteers, we have great teams, we have great mentors, and we're gonna have a great season with Velocity Vortex. I'm saying welcome to our other kickoff sites um, here in Portland, but we also have First Tech Challenge uh, kickoffs going on in the Dells, Bend and Medford. Thank you all for making this our largest kickoff event ever. So, how do you get in the game? Whether you are a veteran team or a rookie team, you get in the game by first playing your FTC national registration fee of $275. Some of you have already been awarded a first uh, Robotics First Tech Challenge rookie or veteran credit that's been applied to your profile. So that's been taken care of for you. Everyone else needs to pay the 275. You need to have a valid registered team number to get in the game. Next, what do you need to know? When are we doing all of our events and all of our activities? We have a season schedule posted at ortop.org slash FTC. If you look in the center column, that's your key to the most most pertinent links and information that you need to know about this season. You'll find out when all the tournaments are happening, when all the league meets are happening, and we'll be updating that information continuously. So how about the first part of it? Signing up. Sign up for Oregon league play uh, tournaments or qualifying tournaments that begin, let's see, September 15th. I promise on September 15th, I will have the link up so that you can fill out that form with all of your information. This will close. If you want to participate in a league, you must have everything in and your form in by October 15th. If you want to participate in just qualifying tournaments and not participate in a league, you have until November 1. But as of November 1, all teams must be registered with not only the national organization, but with ORTOP so that we can plan and go ahead and see how many tournaments that we need to have. Once November 2 happens, I'm sorry, you can, you can play at home, but you won't be playing with us. Next. You've heard our other speakers today, and I really want to thank Aaron Curls, our championship referee. Al uh, Van Noy and Robert Sweeter as our judge advisors, and Dale Jordan as our first tech challenge, uh, uh, first tech challenge field technical advisor for all their sage advice they've given you today. And you've heard it, and I'm going to say it again. First Tech Challenge is a literacy program. It's also about science, technology, engineering, and math, plus more, but there's a lot of reading to do. Let's see here. And I want you to keep up with communications. Share the reading on your team. You should start every team meeting with the communications meeting and find out what someone learned by reading it on the forum. What did someone read, find out by reading Game Manual 2? How can you connect those? You can also look at the volunteer manuals. Every volunteer manual that, is, that we have is going to be available to teams. If you read those, you'll have a better idea what the volunteers are being trained to do and it'll help you prepare as well. Also, there are team resources on web pages and other teams in First Tech Challenge across the entire country and the entire world also offer all kinds of wonderful advice and key learnings. And if you keep up with them, then you maybe you'll learn something that'll help you make your robot and your season better. Communication. We have several ways of communicating in First Tech Challenge, and I want to point them out. First of all, there are websites. The national website, firstinspires.org, and there is our ORTOP website, ORTOP.org slash FTC. I will be posting key links up there, so it's like one-stop shopping, like Fred Meyer. You can go to that one spot and then click all the links that you, the most important links that you need to, to help you with your season. Emails and blogs. First Tech Challenge puts out a team blast. Those will go to primary coaches that are registered. For my blog, I have it up on the website, and I will send out an email to everyone, anyone and everyone that's on ORTOP FTC uh, Google group, and so you get notification that there's a new blog published, and there will be information about First Tech Challenge Oregon, things that are pertain to us. And finally, social media. 
First is very big about putting uh, just uh, some key resources that'll make your season better. They use Twitter and they use Facebook. Um, and you should uh, tune in on looking at those as well. Make, make someone make that assignment, you'll look at the social media. First Tech Challenge Oregon also uses a Facebook page and I will also uh, push stuff up that I see from those other sources as well as things that, uh, some fun stuff, uh, sharings from other teams and so that we also have a presence on social media doing that. Currently, um, you might have read throughout leading up to this kickoff, our game hints that we've been putting out. Is this photo a game hit or not? So we've been having a lot of fun with that. Let me take a look. What else did I want to tell you? I want to just go back and briefly talk to you about our schedule. Um, after we have the teams registered for league or not league, we will be starting league meets in November and we'll have primarily two league meet weeks in November and two in December. Exactly when the dates are will depend on the specific league, but we are planning on having as many as 12 leagues this year. Every place that we had them last year, plus we are hoping to, or, uh, hoping to add another league and the Southern Oregon Coast. And one more thing. Whether you are on the Red Alliance or the Blue Alliance, put your best feet forward, work as a team, be gracious professionals, and have fun.